Assalamu alaikum. Today I will show you how to add new material in CST. For this, at first we have to open CST. Here is the CST for adding new material. I would like to create a new project here. So click on new template and uh, click on the point, uh, criteria as per requirement. Here I would like to design an antenna. So I'll click on antennas and press next and press accordingly. Here I put frequencies, random frequencies. You have to put these frequencies as per your requirement. So I would like to observe all these characteristics and uh, you can add the frequencies here for observing those characteristics more specifically and particularly. So uh, I have to finish this, this and this window will appear. Next, my work is very simple. I have to uh, create on modeling as you know, adding any material we have to click on the modeling and then we have to click on the brick this is the brick if we click on the brick this dialog box will appear and you have to click on the escape so by clicking escape you can add any material here mm, i write some specification for our new material this is our material i named it as abc you can uh, add uh, any material suppose cnt is not available in cst so you can add cnt you can add ito is not available there you can add ito or if you want to design a tumor then the layer are not available here then you can add the layers like fat or the tumor layer here uh, for this we have to know some characteristics here i put some characteristics randomly for abc material uh, so in case you add any new material, you have to know some characteristics. It is not necessary to know all the characteristics, but you have to know uh, certain characteristics to design the antenna. Or as you design a new material, you may know what are the characteristics required for the material uh, to design your specific antennas or any other devices. So here I would like to add the new material ABC. Uh, here I have to put the name. I would like to put the name as ground. As you know, in my crystal patch antenna, there is a layer named the ground. I have to put uh, the uh, values of the length and width and thickness. Here I put some random values as I make this video for adding new material purpose, not for designing any particular devices. So I put some random values, uh, zero. 0.018 so here is the option here we see the new material option here just for adding new material click on material or you if you want to add the material already available you have to load it from the material library so if we click at new material Here is the new material window. So just rename it as ABC, ABC, and you have to select Click on the modeling, then click on the bricks and then escape. You have to I you have to write down the name of the material here, then some parameters.
and here is the window where you find the new material so click on the new material window then rename it the material as i provide the name here as abc so the name of the material is a b c then type of the material here i if we check the type here it is lossy metal so type of the material it is uh, lossy lossy metal so um, electric conductivity electric conductivity is available here 6.8 into 10 to the power 8 so electrical conductivity 6.8 into 10 to the power 8 after that you can select the color of your material and um, mu value is 1 and ruho is 8930 so we can put other values accordingly like thermal conductivity whether it is available here or not let me check the thermal conductivity 801 so 401 sorry so 401 then you can heat capacity or other parameters are here available or not heat capacity 0 0.39 so heat capacity 0 0.39 then let me check other properties uh, diffusivity young's modulus diffusivity if it is available here just put it here and uh, young modulus so we see young modulus is here 120 poisson ratio 0 0.33 young modulus young modulus 120 poisson ratio is 0 0.33 0 0.33 and thermal expansion coefficient what about it it is 17 so thermal expansion is 17 then click ok and you can see the preview first you can see the preview uh, for this you have to go to your component you can see the preview here here is the preview of our ground layer and this layer uh, we used abc and new material click ok so this is the material we used uh, we create in cst that this is how you can create any new material in cst thank you thank you for watching and hopefully this video will help you in in future thank you